In this video, I would like to show how to draw individual rooms differently from the rest of the floor, in terms of level, how to raise or lower them. And for this, I first draw an example room, and as an extension, a second room. The second room should now be raised. This is what my building looks like in 3D mode, and it is important that this wall is not drawn as a whole, but in two parts. That's why I can now click on this wall on the right, go to construction, then to levels and check the box here, and set different levels from the story. Now I'm lifting this wall by 70 units at the top and bottom, also around 70 units. I say units because if you go here in construction mode, you can set the units here. It depends on which units you have set. I'm going into 3D mode, and I now want to demonstrate how to transfer the properties of this wall to the other three without having to re-enter them. I go to Edit, then to Acquire, click on the wall from which the properties are to be taken. Then I select Selected Properties and Wall Axis up here. And now I click on the other two walls and give them the same properties. I'm going to click Escape now to exit the function, and next I want to lift this section of wall from the original building here as well. To do this, I go into construction mode and break this wall in two parts. I go to trim then break. Select the wall with one click. Now the wall is selected. And now I am supposed to select the point where the wall should be broken. Here I select two points and the wall is broken. I am going to click on this part of the wall here and can lift it the same way in 3D mode. But the wall doesn't have to be lifted at the bottom so we will make a check here and raise. The wall by 70 units only at the top but not at the bottom. Next, we need two ceilings that are different from the actual level. I'll show the problem by drawing a cross section to see the house from the side. And we currently have an automatic ceiling that still looks normal here in the left room and it is wrong in the right room. That's why we switch off the normal ceiling once by going to the floor management here. The current floor has been selected. Then we click on edit and make a tick here. It looks a bit distorted for me now because the screen resolution does not match the settings. In the application, that's why you don't see the text correctly here. You put a tick in here if you want to hide the ceiling on this floor. The automatic ceiling, I click OK. Then I go back to 2D views. Here was the ceiling. Now I'm refreshing my house and I see that the ceiling is now gone. Next I'll draw my own ceilings by going to step here. I make a polygon and I draw the ceiling in the interior. and it is drawn. You can see that here on the left is the ceiling. Then next I go to construction and draw a rectangular ceiling here in the other room. I go into 3D mode. It's wrong now. I'm lifting it by 70 units and it now looks like this. Now the floor is still wrong. We click on the room, go to elevations, then use different floor thickness and add 70. Units more than before and the floor is now right in the right place 
and you could copy this floor and draw exactly such a floor over it by clicking Add Story. Now then click on Copy All Walls and click OK, and exactly such a floor is copied. Now I would only have to copy the ceilings over once, there too. I'll fade out the second floor for once. I click on the ceiling on the left. Then I press the control key on the keyboard. Click on the ceiling on the right. Right click edit. Copy to another story and select the next story here. So now I fade in all the floors again. And here are the two ceilings that were copied. Now I wanted to say at the end that there is this hole here because the wall doesn't know exactly how to connect to the left or to the right and to get rid of it you should click on construction once and then t-trim each wall with the other ones i click on trim t-trim and i click on the wall and i trim each wall with the other one now the hole is closed and looks like this